Hi, I'm Ross, and today I'm going to show you how to set fire to some metal. We don't normally think of metal as being flammable. And if I try and set a light to this piece of steel, we don't get very far. Now, the reason for this is because you need three things for a flame. Heat, fuel, and oxygen. This is known as the fire triangle. Our fuel is the iron in our piece of steel. You'll have seen iron burn for yourself when handling a sparkler. We got the heat from the match, but the iron in our lump of steel doesn't have enough oxygen to set it alight. Adding oxygen to something is also known as oxidation, but this is normally something we try to avoid. If pure iron is left exposed to water and oxygen, it forms iron oxide, also known as rust. So this is why we tend to paint over iron bridges. So the iron in our lump of steel needs to be exposed to more of that oxygen. So instead of this, we're going to use some steel wool, which will accelerate the burning and oxidation. I also want to experiment with a different form of ignition. Instead of a match, we're going to be using a 9 volt battery. Now, the reason this works so well is because it can generate a short circuit when connected to the steel wall. A huge current flows through the wire, meaning it gets really, really hot, about 700 degrees Celsius hot, which is much hotter than a match. Before we start our experiment, I should stress that if you are going to try this at home, please take care and use common sense. The steel wool gets very hot and may even spark a little. So we're going to be using some eye protection. We're using an oven-proof dish and heat-proof mats. We've got fire extinguishers and a fire blanket nearby. And don't return to the steel wool until it's cooled down. Ideally, you want to be doing this outside. Right, let's burn some metal. We place the wool into the dish. We take our battery and gently brush it against the wall. If you enjoyed this video, then why not check out some of our other experiments for you to try at home. And for more science every week, click subscribe. Thanks for watching.